All right, what's going on, y'all? Going old school uh, for my first weekly results vid for my Pio and T25 hybrid. Now, last time y'all saw me on video, I was just doing strictly Pio, and y'all might be wondering where is the final results vid for that. Well, I decided not to do it because, uh, quite honestly, my second month. Uh, I kind of just went through the motions and didn't really finish off strong so I just really didn't want to post anything if I didn't really go 100% at it. So um, starting over again I am still doing Pio except I wanted to add a little variety with T25. Uh, so I've actually done my first week and today is going to be my way in. I decided to go old school a little bit with my shirt off. Uh, I used to start my uh, these videos with my shirt off usually, uh, but just because I've not been proud of my appearance lately, I've just decided to keep my shirt on. But I think I'm gonna go back uh, old school here. So just so y'all can see my um, how my physical appearance is gonna change in the next coming weeks, uh, because I'm on a mission to drop 20 pounds in the next two months so this time I'm gonna do it but uh, with that being said I'll explain everything to y'all a little bit later uh, but let's go ahead and get on the scale and see where I came in at this week I think I started at like at 227.8 if I'm not mistaken so let's see what happens 227.6 alright guys so that was my way in for week number one but of course, uh, I don't look at just the scale. I look at the whole picture as far as, you know, my body weight, um, me, my body fat percentage is concerned. And um, I also recorded my measurements as well. So uh, with that being said, let me go ahead and get into that part. Um, hold on one second. Uh, let's see, my chest was 39.7. Um, I really should have wrote down. Um, where I measured at last week, I really don't remember. I think it was maybe like 40 something, so but it's not that much of a change. Uh, bicep stayed at 12 um, from last week. Thighs actually went down. Uh, I think I was like at 24.3, if I remember correctly. Some of these I remember like um, off the top of my head, some of them I don't. Uh, but I'm at 23.4 today. So I lost a little bit uh, in the thigh area. Waist uh, actually came down a little bit. Waist is the easiest one for me to remember because uh, that's the one I'm most concerned about. But my waist was actually at 35.8 last week. It's at 35.1 now. So uh, getting back down there. Um, and let's see. That's really the only thing that I measure. Everything else I'm really not concerned about. Those are the like the four main areas. Chest. Um, chest, arms, waist, and thigh. Uh, but that being said, those are my measurements for this week. Um, as far as my body fat percentage, right now I am currently at 12.7% body fat. And my goal is probably to be around 10%. Realistically, I, I expect to get down to 10%. Maybe 9 but I'm, I'm shooting for 10 but uh, my overall goal is to shoot for 20 pounds uh, as far as my weight loss is concerned. So they'll put me at 207 at the end of the, uh, these 60 days. So we'll see what happens. Uh, I just feel like I'm a little. I'm gonna be a little bit more focused this time. Um, if you haven't followed me on Facebook or Instagram, I've been uh, posting on there daily. I decided this time around, I'm just going to post every day what I ate, how my nutrition was, good or bad. Um, also, what I did as far as my workout that day because I just looked back and I was like, what worked back then that I'm not really doing now? And I think it was that accountability part that I'm not doing on a daily basis. Even on here, I used to come on here every week with you guys when I was doing Insanity and Insanity Asylum and you saw the results I got from those programs just by coming on here on a weekly basis uh, staying accountable and I think I just got kinda lazy you know coming on here monthly uh, in some cases uh, bi-monthly um, and not really staying consistent so I think that's really a key factor as far as uh, me hitting my goals or not uh, so you will be seeing me every week um, but if y'all want to see what I'm doing on a daily basis, I recommend that you follow me either on you, probably Facebook. You'll get the most um, out of me on Facebook. 
uh, but Instagram as well. Uh, my links will be down in the description box if you uh, want to be follow me on either one of those social media sites. But anyway, um, yeah, that's going to be about it for this week. Um, I really wasn't expecting that much because I'm really getting back into the you know swing of things and whatnot. Um, so that being said, I did po um, I didn't post the workout yet, but I have recorded it and I'm going to edit it alongside this video. So um, this video and my workout video should probably come out at the same time. So uh, I will have the link to the workout video. And most of the workouts I'm going to be showing are from Pio because y'all have already seen my T25 bids. Um, but most of them are going to be from Pio since I did not film any workouts. Well, I did, but I just didn't post them. Uh, I still have some that are unedited, and I'm probably just going to delete them and get rid of them anyway. Uh, so, I think I did Pio Scope this week. So, that's, what's, that's the one I'm going to show y'all. So, the link will be up uh, probably somewhere right here, maybe. Uh, just click on that and you know uh, see what the workout is like or whatnot. Um, so that being said, I'm gonna go ahead and close it out right here. I will definitely see you guys next week as I will be here on a weekly basis. And um, yeah, that's gonna be it. See y'all next time. Peace.